Yo, what is up guys? Kansas Marvel here, back at it again with another LEGO DC Super Villains video. Alright guys, so today we've got another Mortal Kombat custom, uh, and that is going to be a Fire God Liu Kang. So, um, this is one of those characters that looks much, much cooler <laughs> in Mortal Kombat in like the actual game than in here, uh, in this customizer. Uh, this one I think just turned out a little bit too, uh, too simple, you know, there was, there was a lot of pieces that just didn't, um, weren't as accurate to, to, uh, Liu Kang in Mortal Kombat 11 as I would have liked. Uh, for example, you know, his hair, I couldn't find the right hair piece because he has a, a very, um, he has a different hair, uh, than just regular Liu Kang. And then also his arms with, like, the dragon tattoos and stuff. So, yeah, it was a little bit hard, but, um, I don't know. I still think it looks like Fire God Liu Kang. It just doesn't look as cool as the actual, you know, Liu Kang from, uh, Mortal Kombat 11. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and get started, guys, with this custom. Alright, so first things first, you want to go over to head, and, um, the head I used... So I went over to preset and uh, I was gonna use Superman's I believe, which is the same one I used for uh, for this Liu Kang custom uh, a while back ago when I made the regular Liu Kang. But I decided to go with the Doctor Fate just because he has that white headband on his head and uh, he does wear a headband on his hair, not on his forehead. But unfortunately, we can't give him a headband. There's not a piece with a headband on the hair, so we have to just uh, go with the the one. We just we just gonna have to go with this one that has the headband on his forehead. All right, so for the hair, um. This was another thing that I did not like. So Liu Kang, uh, Fire God Liu Kang, has like a ponytail. Has like a yeah. Has he has like a bun on top and then like long hair. So it's kind of a mix of this uh, bun here and this long hair. Uh, but I just went with the long hair just because, um, like I said, this is probably the most accurate piece you're gonna find. Because uh, there's really nothing that really you know replicates that hair piece uh, in this customizer here. So yeah, I just went ahead and went, went with long. Uh, and I went ahead and made like this uh, silverish grayish color. Because this hair is not like, it's not fully white, but it's not gray. It's kind of in between. It looks pretty cool. Alright, so for the body, I just went over to preset. I mean, I went over to custom, and then I went over to custom again. Oh, actually, first thing, what you want to do, uh, you want to go over to um to the Bane body. And it's all the way up here. Yeah, you want to go over to the Bane body first, and then you want to go over to the, just the regular body, and go to custom body number 5, and it's 10. Alright. So for color number two, you want to go ahead and make it black just so you can see all this, you know, muscle definition and stuff. All right, so next for the hands, uh, you just want to go over to the hands and make them skin tone color. <laughs> and for the arms, um, there's two options you can go with. Uh, the first one is just go all the way up to blank and give them, you know, straight white arms. And it looks fine, I guess, but uh, what makes this, uh, what makes Fire God Luke King look so cool, well, one of the reasons I think it makes him, one of the reasons I think it looks awesome is because he has, like, white dragon tattoos on his arms, which look awesome. And um, this is kind of just a little bit too plain, so I, I I I was looking around and trying to find stuff that would look cool. And the best thing that I found was probably uh, Eclipso, and I went ahead and made it. Uh, I didn't make it completely white. I made it like this really really light silver color, like that. And I mean it's not exactly you know the <laughs> the dragon tattoos that we see in MK11, but I mean it's something you know it's you know some detail on his arms. But it's better honestly it's better than than being blank in my opinion. But if you don't like the way it looks, you can always just go with the blank arms. Alright, so for the hips, I just went over to Black Adams and went ahead and did those. Uh, for the legs, um, let's see. Okay, yeah. So for the legs, I went over to Commissioner Gordon and I went ahead and made them white. Alright, so that's pretty much it for the design. Like I said, it's a very simple design. It doesn't look as awesome as the one from MK11, as the actual Fire God Luke King from MK11. But I still think he looks alright. <laughs> so let's go ahead and give him some effects. So for the effects, I went ahead and just gave him uh, two effects and went ahead and gave him the orange for the fire. Because after all, you know, he is the fire god and stuff. I do wish I could have given him, like, a blue effect or something for his arms. Like, made it look like lightning. That would have looked awesome. Because he, he does, he has the ability to control lightning and uh, fire. Because he's, like, Raiden and Liu Kang fused into one, which is pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, we can't do that. So, we're just going to stick with the fire. Alright, so that's pretty much it for the design. Well, actually, let me just quickly go over to the effects. Cause I actually forgot. Uh, so, for the hit impact, I went ahead and gave him orange. And for the, uh... Jump slime effect. I'm going to give more chance. All right, cool. So moving on to the personality. So for the health icon, uh, you want to go ahead and make it. Uh, did have orange? Yeah. Go ahead and make it orange. Health type. Make sure it's standard. Voice. Make sure he has a male voice. Target reticle. Uh, make sure it's <laughs> Death Storm. That's going to be the best one. Speed normal. And for the animation style, you want to go ahead and give him martial artist. All right, guys. So on to the. So we're not going to be giving it. We're not going to be giving him any weapons. But now on to the abilities. So for triangle, we'll leave it blank. For X, um. Can he fly? See, I always I always get this confused because I know Raiden, I think he can fly. I'm not even sure though. Uh, you know what? For the second things, we won't give him fly. We'll just give him double jump. Yeah. 
Wait, why not? <laughs> we'll give him a double jump. Uh, for X, we're going to give him hyper jump. Uh, for tap circle, well, for tap square, we'll give him, uh, I believe, a blank. And then for hold square, we'll go ahead and give him a fire beam, which I think is fire beam number, let's see. Go with four. Um, heat beam, color, make sure it's orange. And then for the uh, beam origin, we'll go ahead and give him both hands. All right. So moving on to tap circle. So for tap circle, we'll go ahead and give him bolts coming out of both of his hands. Um, we'll go ahead and make them bolt style. Yeah, bolt style number three. Uh, make sure they're orange and bolt damage. Make sure it's uh, heat. All right. So moving on to hold. To hold, we're going to give it a fire explosion. Actually, you know what? We'll give him a lightning explosion attack. Yeah. So we'll go with explosion effect number. Um, go with the lightning one. Yeah. yeah. Number two. Uh, beam, uh, explosion style number. Explosion to be yeah number three. Uh, and then we're gonna make it electric. And then the color, we'll go ahead and make it uh, this blue here, this lightning blue. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, so moving on to skills. For skills, we'll leave grappling off, we'll leave technology off, we'll give him acrobat definitely, no mind control, no telekinesis, uh, wall climbing, smash wall, super strength, no chlorokinesis, uh, no beam deflect. Actually, yeah, we'll give him beam deflect. Uh, no group command, no x ray, no graffiti, we'll give him tracking, uh, hazard protection, because he has a god, illumination, and should we give him stealth? No, no stealth. Alright guys, that's pretty much it for our custom Fire God Luke King. Now all we gotta do is take him out to the Metropolis help world and showcase him around for you. So uh, I know this is uh, you know my second Mortal, Mortal Kombat custom in a row. Uh, and I do plan on making another one, so tomorrow I'll probably be making a different uh, custom. It won't be probably won't be MK, just because like I said, I've already made two. So I kinda just wanna change thing, things up a bit. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I might make the, the Tick and Arthur, because I know uh, you guys, uh, one of my subscribers, uh, really wants me to make that custom. So I, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and make him tomorrow. Alright guys, so here he is, our fire god Luke Kang in LEGO DC Super Villains. Uh, so yeah, like I said, he looks um, he looks pretty cool, I guess. Uh, definitely not as cool as the fire god Luke Kang from uh, MK11. But I still think he looks alright, you know. For 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 what, what for what I had to work with in the customizer, I think he looks okay. Uh, the one thing that really bothers me, I would say, is probably the hair. I, I do wish I could have found a more accurate looking hair piece. Um, but unfortunately, I couldn't, so yeah. Let's go ahead and just destroy some stuff. I gotta say though, he does look pretty cool, you know, whenever he's using like his, uh, his, uh, his beam and stuff. I should've gave him inv invulnerability, though. I don't know why I didn't. I kinda messed up on that. Oh, where are the cops at? There they are. Boom. Um, is there anybody else? Or just... Yeah, I think I'm just going to go ahead and get out of here. Kind of make this a little bit shorter than usual. I usually make this in like 9 minutes. Go ahead, go, ahead and, go ahead and find a good spot and end it on. End it on there. Um, where should I end it? I think I'm going to go to the Hall of Justice. Yeah, that seems like a second place for Fire God Luke King. I do got to say that, man. I think just Fire God Luke King is a pretty, pretty cool looking character, man. He's awesome. Like the whole, like the whole concept and idea, and like just design and everything of this character is pretty cool. Alright, there we go. Alright guys, so that was the video, hopefully you guys enjoyed it and liked this custom. Uh, stay tuned for more customs coming soon, like I said I'll probably have another, a different custom tomorrow. Uh, so stay tuned for that. But thank you guys for watching, have a great day guys, see you all in the next video, take care.